There is a whole lot to love about the Pixel 8a. Google's newest A-series phone is a smaller and cheaper alternative to last year's Pixel 8 and Pixel 8 Pro, taking many of the best features of the top-end device and cramming them into a mid-range phone costing $499. US dollar. Arriving 6 months after the flagship Pixels and 6 months before the expected announcement of the Pixel 9, the Pixel 8a is more than just a mid-generation stepping stone. The phone gets Google's fastest Tensor G3 processor as expected, which brings with it access to many of the headline-grabbing AI features previously exclusive to the most expensive Pixels. That means the Pixel 8a gets clever photo editing tools like the base take, which lets you tap on friends' faces in group photos to pick a better expression and achieve the perfect shot. You also get the powerful Magic Editor tool, Google's trademark AI feature, which lets you reposition, delete the resize and subjects in photos and have generative AI seamlessly fill in the gaps. At US$499, Google's newest affordable Android phone occupies an awkward position in the Pixel range. It does pretty much everything the Pixel 8 can, but with the Pixel 8 regularly on sale for as little as US$550, the cheaper Pixel 8a looks like less of a bargain. Setting aside the potential to pick up the original Pixel 8 at a discount, we can still say that the Pixel 8a is remarkably good value for money. Here is our review. If you wanted a cuter, more curvaceous version of the Pixel 8, the Pixel 8a delivers. Sure, it looks like every other Pixel phone since the Pixel 6, but that's brand identity. I actually like the camera bar, I prefer its symmetry to the camera bump on most other phones. The Pixel 8a has nicely rounded corners and some flashy color options including the brighter than expected aloe green of my review sample, a nice step into the light from the more subdued mint green Pixel 8. The back is plastic, not glass, but the mid finish and great colors make it look much more premium than the ugly plastic phones of your. Glossy plastic is out, the Pixel 8a is in. Otherwise, it's a Pixel and you know what that looks like by now, it looks like every other Pixel. I mean the two tone options of the Pixel 6 phones, but it is still a pretty phone that will stand out just enough from the herd of Galaxy and iPhones. Google's new so-called Actual Display were a key selling point for the Pixel 8 family, so I am pleased to report that Pixel 8a earns its spot in the lineup with a bright, colorful display that doesn't skimp on specs. It has a 120Hz refresh rate and the same 2000 nit brick brightness potential as the Pixel 8. The bezel is a bit thick, but you won't notice unless you hold it up next to another phone. The smaller size of the Pixel 8a with its 6.1 inch OLED display is one of my favorite aspects of its design. It's a nice compact phone. I had some trouble seeing the display in the bright California sunshine in Mountain View which made some photography hard but this was only a problem on the clearest day with the sun overhead. Indoors the display seemed exceptionally bright so perhaps it just needed a better reflective coating. The OnePlus 12R does have a larger 6.7 inch display and OnePlus claims it can hit an eye pricing 4500 nits of brightness but we haven't seen it achieve this in our tests. Still for the same price you can get a larger display but the compact size is part of the Pixel 8a appeal. Google's Pixel A series phones are usually an easy pick for the best bargain camera phone because they are unfuzzy and produce great images that are perfect for sharing online. By that I mean they don't look great if you zoom in too close. But for viewing on smaller screens, the Pixel 8a makes photos that look surprisingly good. How good? To test the Pixel 8a camera, I compared photos against the Pixel 8 Pro, Google's best camera phone and one of my favorites. 
The photos were remarkably similar. If I didn't zoom in on a shot, I often couldn't tell which photo was taken by the Pixel 8a and which by the Pixel 8 Pro. Google's color and light balancing are nearly identical on both phones. Only in the darkest conditions was the Pixel 8 Pro advantage clear. To compare with the Google Pixel 8 Pro, here is a sample that shows more detail from the Pro camera but both images look good. The color and lighting is very similar across both devices. Here you can see some camera samples of Google Pixel 8a. The Pixel 8a is my new favorite bargain phone and if you need a new phone for less, the Pixel 8a gives you more than you would expect. You get Google's latest and greatest mobile AI tools plus 7 years of Android updates in a package that's colorful and durable. You won't find so much of the future in any other phone that's this affordable.